What's going on guys? It's Tim Plays here and today we are back with another Minecraft video for you guys. We're back here with another survival video. We're going to be starting a brand new series once again. I know we've been doing a lot of series lately, but today is going to be a long series that I hope you guys do enjoy. So this one is going to be one block minecraft skyblock so you guys have probably already seen a bunch of these videos out there on youtube already but i decided to make one myself because a lot of people have been enjoying them and i hope you guys do enjoy them too so let's check it out guys we are starting off on a single block right here guys as you guys can see it says break the block below you and you know what I'm gonna do exactly that guys and guess what happens so it breaks the block will regenerate it is an infinite block so this will always keep on spotting it there's a bunch of tears to this there's a bunch of cool stuff that comes out of this single block so this is gonna be the first few days of this entire series and I hope you guys do enjoy this video there's gonna be a lot coming in the future but I hope you guys do enjoy this one so leave a like down below if you guys do enjoy and subscribe if you guys are new to the channel but anyways guys let's get right into this we got ourselves some oh wood right off the bat and we are making moves guys we're making moves i don't know how we're gonna go to the end and like the nether and stuff but we're gonna figure that out as we keep on breaking these blocks there are 10 phases to this apparently each phase has a theme so apparently this first phase is called the plains phase and it's basically oh we got ourselves a nice little piggy here so there's gonna be 10 other phases we don't know what they're called but i'm guessing each phase is going to give us more and more stuff and even better stuff. So this one says there, fitting mobs and blocks spawn. So I guess we can get ourselves a nice little piggy here. I do want to make a fence for it, guys. I do want to keep this piggy. Bam, 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 bam. He should be safe in here. And we got ourselves an oak sapling which is perfect because we are going to be able to get wood much easier now. Hopefully we get pretty far in this world. Blocks like gravel fall down. Wait, oh, we can't even get gravel because there's no blocks underneath it. I need some water somehow. Once I get some water, I should be able to get these blocks and hopefully it'll make everything a little easier. I'm gonna get myself a shovel to make this whole process a little quicker. I need some more dirt, so hopefully they do give me some more dirt. There, oh, we got a water bucket, that's perfect. Now we can actually place blocks under the gravel. Place a block underneath this, what should I do? I'll place a wood block so I don't break it super quickly. Let's get that. I'll see you guys in a bit, guys. I'm gonna be mining here for quite a bit and hopefully I don't mess anything up, guys. Ready for an adventure? Of course I'm ready for an adventure. Oh, upgrade in 10 seconds. I thought that bedrock was going to be there forever. I was going to be so mad. But there it is, guys. I think we passed the first phase of this whole thing. You've raged phase one, the plants. Wait. We were still on phase zero. I thought that was phase one. Enough flowers and trees grow here to last a lifetime. Click to open the menu. We don't need to do any of that. But yeah, guys, we have started our entire journey on the one block sky block world. And it looks like we're doing pretty good for ourselves. Hopefully we can get ourselves some cobblestone, some lava or something so I can make myself a cobblestone generator. But... I'm not sure guys. You know what? I'm gonna stop building out of dirt and just start moving on to wood because we get ourselves more wood than we do anything else. So start placing down some trees. So I'm gonna place these trees down pretty close to each other because I don't think oak trees really need that much room. They're just gonna be one block apart like so. Bam, bam. We got some trees growing over there. Oh, we got ourselves another piggy push this piggy in real quick come on all right we got two pigs already let's go get in there yes we got two pigs now we got two pigs inside of our farm kind of just looking like a huge long platform right now which i don't like but this should do for now man it's already nighttime the first day is about to run out and i barely made any progress in this one day guys we got ourselves some melons some pumpkins we got ourselves two pigs but not too much more than that Oh, we got ourselves some chickens. They're giving me too many animals, guys. They're giving me too many animals, and I don't have any room for these guys just yet. Nope. I did say I was going to wait until I get some more stuff, but just looking at it, there's quite a bit of animals out here already. I might as well just make ourselves some birch fences. It's a little too late now, but oh well. Let's just get ourselves some birch fences out here. And hopefully this is enough to keep these guys safe. Come on, sheep. You're going into your own little fence right here. Nice. The chickens, 
They're just gonna have to stay with the pigs for now. <laughs> the chickens are just gonna stay with the pigs for now. They'll figure it out someday, but I gotta get these pigs and these cows in. I don't have any wheat right now, so that's a big issue. If I only had some wheat or some, like, carrots, that would save this whole process, but I only got melons. Got some more pigs, and push the pig into its new home right here. There we go. I placed this block down right here because it forces all the animals that spawn to land like a little bit higher up. And all I gotta do is just push them in, which makes it a lot easier. I didn't think of this before because these guys are kind of just roaming around by themselves already. But now that I have thought of it, all these animals can just get pushed into its respective fence gates. I should probably start growing out these seeds. We're also going to get some melon seeds growing. Why not? Because we got some room for them. Place them all down and this should be good for now. Oh, upgrade in 20 seconds, guys. We have finished phase one. We are moving on to phase two already. I think that was a pretty good phase. Not going to lie. I think we did pretty good. I want to move this sheep over into the right fence area let's move them over and there we go we got ourselves some more stuff we finally got ourselves some stone this is huge this is huge we can actually start getting ourselves some cobblestone which is big phase number two the underground which is gonna change this whole game up let's hurry up and start breaking this cobblestone right here perfect and guys i am actually so excited let's get this started real quick we're gonna get ourselves a bunch of stuff already guys this is looking pretty good so far some iron wait they're giving us so much resources so quick and we don't even have to work for it because it's just placing it right in front of us all right we got ourselves a mushroom this is huge you know why we just make ourselves a bowl like this we got ourselves four bowls we could just spam them out we got ourselves four mushroom stews just like that we have infinite food now we don't even need to kill these pigs we don't need to kill the cows we don't need to kill the chickens we don't need to kill any of these guys because mushroom it just gives us everything so we're basically set for food oh my gosh there is zombies why are there zombies on this? I didn't know mobs spawned from these. What is this? All right, we finally got ourselves an iron pick, which is going to change this whole process so much. Now, everything should be so much faster to get. I'll probably just get myself some stone tools right now because there doesn't seem to be enough iron smelting. And, oh, we got ourselves some bunnies. Oh, my God. All oh, my animals. Oh, my gosh. Nobody told me creepers spawn out of those. Oh my gosh, all my hard work just gone like that, huh? I guess I gotta keep that in mind now, okay? <laughs> We're gonna have to do a bit of work. We are gonna have to move all these animals pretty far away from this block because this block right here is dangerous. It is very dangerous. All right, guys, we are moving all of these blocks over somewhere pretty far away because I don't want any more creepers blowing up my stuff. Alright guys, after a little bit of work, I got myself a nice little pen system over here. It is kind of small, but once I got this whole thing rolling, it looks pretty good in my opinion. I'll just show you guys how it's going to work. Place down a block right here, get ourselves a ladder, and we can get out that way. But it'll make sure that the animals can't get out themselves, and I think it looks pretty good in my opinion. So we got ourselves a nice little system right here. We are going to get out our wheat. We're gonna get these mushrooms over here, and these guys are gonna be the first customers on our farm. There's one, we got the second guy in there, and there's two guys. We got ourselves two mushrooms in there. There we go, we got most of them in. We can just move all these fences out of the way. I don't want any more creepers near my stuff, so we're gonna get rid of all of this. Another thing I should probably do is stay a few blocks away so I don't die. I'm actually just gonna break some of these blocks right here pathway down below something like this and now all i gotta do is sit back here and we can break the block safely <laughs> we don't have to worry about dying to any of this i think this is pretty smart guys i know most of these blocks aren't going to be picked up for now but look at that the zombies can't even touch me because they're so far away and once i'm ready i just hop back out and we can kill these zombies real quick 
Hopefully we can kill these zombies real quick. One more, there we go. And now all we gotta do is head over here, pick up these blocks, and just throw them in the chest. We are ready to keep on mining. Guys, look. There's a creeper right there. We don't even need to worry about it. You know, because we're so far away, it doesn't even see us. We have finally fixed the problem, guys. We have finally fixed the problem. We gotta deal with the creeper now. No, please don't blow up. Please don't blow up. Hit it. Run back, run back, run back. Hit it again. Run back, run back. And one last hit. Phew. Oh my gosh. Why is it so stressful? Why is this so stressful? Ooh, we're upgrading already, guys. We are moving on to phase number three three guys it's taken a bit of time it says 30 seconds this time we have moved on to phase number three icy tundra winter covers the land with its icy hands that is our next phase guys we are moving pretty quick in this game guys we are already on phase three out of phase 10 that's so quick this is just the first episode and i think it's only been like five days on this minecraft world so not too much has happened yet I just realized I don't have a bed on this world just yet and we already got some sheep so why don't I just go over here cheer these sheep real quick get ourselves a bed because we could just go to sleep right now and that bunny just jumped off the edge did you guys just see that there's no way to I don't know what to say about that guys <laughs> what did that buddy do there's no way i'm gonna be able to sleep after that one anyways guys day six starting right here guys we are gonna get started right off the bat just keep on mining because we got ourselves a new phase which mean new blocks which we have already gotten and we got ourselves some ice which i can't really do much with it so just gonna have to break it and move on for now Ooh, we got ourselves a wolf this is huge. I kind of want to keep this wolf as a pet, but I don't have any bones on us. So just going to have to wait a bit. <gasps> oh, we got ourselves. Come on. Don't, don't kill the wolf, please. Please don't kill the wolf. Oh my gosh. All right. The wolf is still alive. We got some more drowns. Hopefully they don't kill me. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm not doing so good on this world, guys. I'm not very good at Minecraft, apparently. <laughs> and the wolf died. Oh my gosh, everything's just going downhill. I haven't even done anything. My wolf died. I guess we just gotta keep moving forward and hopefully we don't make the same mistakes. Ooh, we got ourselves a white fox. Wait, this is actually so cool. Please don't fall off the edge. Block it off as fast as possible. There we go. We got ourselves a new pet. Oh my gosh. This one's even better. All right. I don't even care about the fox anymore. We got ourselves a better pet. This is awesome. All right. We got some more strays, but this time I got myself a shield. What are you going to do now? Oh, I'm about to die. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. I'm sorry I said anything. Whew. You know, I could just keep on mining, but I kind of feel like starting to build something. So... I'm thinking I'm gonna move all of this stuff right here and make myself a new designated spot just for that, just like how I made this whole spot just for the animals. So I'm gonna do exactly that. We're gonna start building ourselves something on this side instead and make ourselves a nice little farm. So gonna get myself some more slabs real quick. We can start our new little farm on this side right here. All right, guys, after a little bit of more work, I finally got the farm system fully done. All we got to do is get ourselves another source of water so I can make this an infinite water source. But other than that, 
this whole thing is looking pretty nice guys and I cleared up this base a little bit more and it's starting to build pretty well guys I think it's looking kind of nice I'm definitely gonna have to move this tree farm in a little bit but for now I think it looks fine where it is but yeah so everything's looking pretty good we got ourselves three foxes in there I only thought I got one but I guess all three of them decided to go into the same little fence place right there but check it out guys we got a nice little place over here I want to move this pig over over there but this pig isn't really cooperating the other pig wants to go in so let's just push him in real quick and come on just a little bit more and there we go we got all the pigs in everything is looking so good now guys all right anyways I hope you guys do enjoy this video this video wasn't that long I think I've been recording for at least an hour and once I go to sleep this should be day number 10 we should be done for this entire episode, guys. That was day 1 to 10 right there. Hope you guys did enjoy. Make sure to leave a like down below. Subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. Turn on that post notifications. And guys, give me a name for all three of these foxes right here. I want to give them all a name. So hope you guys do enjoy. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in another video. Peace.